Good afternoon, Stout Sunday. Um, another new one here. Another new Thornbridge one, actually. If this is a Thornbridge Dunkel beer. It's Thornbridge Hayden and collaborating with Don Zoko. I've never heard of them, but I've had a bit of a look and apparently they're based in Hartlepool. Um, and this is coming in at 5.2%. Um, Dunkel basically is in German, it means dark. So it's like classed as a dark lager. Um, but you've got to expect notes of sort of, they, they say like toasted uh, bread, um, caramel, chocolatey, I suppose. And with this one, nuts as well. So let's give it a pour. Looking forward to seeing what it's like. Like I say, I ordered about 10 different beers. Um, the two I had yesterday were beautiful. The whip, uh, the whip beer and the a lager collaborating with Budvar. Both really good. So let's see what this is like. It's looking nice. Exactly how you expect a Dunkel to look. Nice and dark. Nice head to it. Oh, that smells, that smells beautiful. Definitely got a bit of a like a sweet caramel note to it, that has. Some of the hops as well. But predominantly for me, like a sweet caramel. Yeah, that's nice. Cheers. That's really another really nice beer. That's beautiful. That's really nice. This was in the fridge all night, and I've just took I've taken it out of the fridge for about thirty minutes because it's saying here between five and eight. So I would say I'm closer to the eight, or even a tiny bit higher. But that to me is really nice. So. Again, a bit like the, the whip beer, the carbonation is quite light. Um, I don't know what notes I'm getting there. You get a nice sort of roasted maltiness to it. It smelt more sweet to me. Whereas there is a hint of sweetness and there's a hint of that caramel there, there as well. I suppose you could say almost, almost a bit like malt loafy. Don't let that put you off, not overly, just a slight bit sort of, I understand what they say with like toasted bread or like a brown bread sort of malt, marmar, um, malt loaf sort of notes to it, but it's a cracking, creamy, almost like say another like almost creamy body to it as well. Absolutely beautiful. It's the first time I've ordered from Thornbridge and what I'm finding with them is I'm actually enjoying more of their different style of beers than their actual IPAs. Um, nothing, not that there's anything wrong with their IPAs, but I just think they're just very, I think it's because there's so many IPAs about and we're almost spoiled with them. I just, I'm finding that up to now, probably say this is the third different style and I'm enjoying the different styles more. So for me, this is absolute another double thumbs up and another cracking beer. If you get the opportunity to try it, try it. Cheers.